All right, I am here with test subject number 44 for the Dimensional Travel Trials. Can you please state your name and date of birth? My name is Barry Finch. I was born April 12th, 1986. All right, um, can you please state your occupation? I'm a former Hollywood stuntman. However, 15 years ago I was paralyzed following a motorcycle accident. Since that time, I've taken a position here at the university as a, as a professor of film history. Okay. Can you please state your reasoning for entering as a subject in this trial experiment? Well, aside from being a contributor to your funding uh, originally and just wanting to, you know, keep tabs on your progress here, I'm about to be a father to twins. All my life, my family has uh, well, had to take care of me. I want to be able to take care of them. I don't, I don't want my disability to burden my children. And I think maybe this project could help with that. Okay. I think that concludes the questionnaire portion of the trial. Let's move on to the next stage. Okay. And you just press that red button three times whenever you're ready. Hey! <laughs> oh, Dr. Jameson. It worked! I'm sorry, uh, I don't think we ever met. I, I can't recall your name. It's, it's me. Barry? We work together? <laughs> anyway, Myra's experiment, it worked. This is going to be a huge breakthrough for the university. Look, I'm very, very sorry, but I think you must be mistaking me for somebody else. But if you're here for the interview, have a seat, and someone will be here for you very shortly. Yeah, hello. Barry, hey, it's Ron. So glad I could catch you. We're uh, running a little early today, so... We're actually going to need you on set by about five, instead of six. Mr. P, I, I'm looking for Susan. I'm sorry, I think you have the wrong apartment. I've lived here since September and there's no one named Susan that lives here, not even on this floor. Well, there you are. Now, what happened? My wife and my family are gone. I'm sorry, do I know who you are? Yes, of course. I'm subject number 44 in your dimensional travel program. Dimensional travel pro no, that's, that's not possible. I've been trying to get funding for that for years. Well, what happened? I was your biggest advocate. And then you sent me back in time so that, so that I could prevent the motorcycle accident that paralyzed me. I think you just answered your own question. What, what do you mean? Well, um, if you went back in time and prevented your accident, then you never had to quit your job, and I guess you never came here or met your wife. Uh, but you can just go back to the machine and fix it. No, Myra, I can't. The, mach the machine disappeared when I showed up here. You have to help me. I'm sorry, I'm not really in a position where I can do that. I would need to spend years researching and collecting funding for it to even be possible. I'm really sorry, but if it makes you feel any better, I once heard that the things we think are our biggest weakness or greatest setbacks can be the best things that ever happened to us. Maybe that can be true with you. It already was.